looks like we have some rain on the way for tomorrow, Andrew, but it really shouldn't affect people in the morning when they're trying to get out there and vote. No, the only thing you're going to have to worry about is uh, just chilly conditions. So a light jacket would be necessary, but we'll get to that here in just a second. How about another dry one? Check out Pinpoint Doppler. Beautiful view here, and you'll see the clear sweep continues at 618. High temperatures located into the lower 70s across eastern Kentucky, and really that's because of the clearing conditions we've looked at. But with clearing conditions comes cooler nights. Those clear skies really allow for temperatures to drop, and you'll notice for tonight we're looking into the lower 40s, 42 in Prestonsburg, and we'll see 44 in Paintsville. We work our way into some of the other regions. You'll see 45 in Jackson, 44 in Hazard, and for the Cumberland Valley temperatures, they're going to be a little bit cooler. Those valley regions get much cooler here at night with 42 degrees in Williamsburg. Now the forecast for election day, 44 degrees for the morning. By the afternoon, 69 degrees, increasing clouds, and some showers going to be on the way, all because a cold front is going to work its way towards eastern Kentucky, and it's going to take its time. Notice clouds increase in the afternoon, really throughout the overnight hours. We'll look at this cold front to push through. That will cool some things off here as we head into your Wednesday. Early rain chances Wednesday at 40%, 56 degrees for your Wednesday. And then notice we are mostly sunny by Thursday, but here comes another cold front. This one going to be drier, 52 degrees on Saturday, so the taste of fall is definitely returning back to the mountains. Yeah, we definitely need the rain tomorrow, so we'll we take do. it. We do. Hopefully we can get a lot of it. All right. Thank you, Andrew. I mean,